That was a uh, pretty special game right there. Um, love to watch these guys come back and uh, fight their way through. Um, you know, we had a uh, great opportunity to maximize on a, an outing where Miner just kept us in it. And, um, you know, he, it could have got away from him. He did a terrific job early on kind of holding that in place and giving us a chance. And um, then the bullpen came in. Obviously not ideal giving up a couple of those those runs, but uh, for our guys to keep coming late like that, Carlos to give us a chance to keep breathing. Uh, and then um, and how about uh, that last one? Beautiful thing to watch. With, that's a tough assignment for Nicky Lopez right there, uh, coming up and laying one down a really tough lefty and then Benny getting creative how to get a run in or at least put pressure on. So I'm uh, real, um, real happy for our guys today. That's the kind of win that um, I've talked about this on opening day, right? Uh, ones that you feed off of, ones that you hope kind of have a hangover effect. Um, you, you have some that can negatively have that hangover, and this is going to be one of those with the positive. All right, questions. Alec Lewis, you started off. Mike, just how would you describe that one? I mean, if you were, I, I know you just ran through it, but just the game as a whole and the length of it and every, I mean, how how would you describe, just describe it? Was it long? I couldn't. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I just, uh, you, you could tell we were going to be in in a fight um, right from the, right from the beginning. And um, the way Mike worked himself out of some stuff, um, and a couple of things, we made some mistakes early, mistakes on the bases and mistakes in the field. And usually uh, those come back and haunt you in games like that. But uh, the guys stayed the course uh, and kept uh, kind of grinding through, had a lot more strikeouts than we wanted. Um, uh, had a few walks, um, but it came down to capitalizing on big opportunities. Um, so, you know, I, I when your game, when you have a game going like that, you don't even realize it's almost a four-hour game. Um, maybe you guys do and our fans do, but you're just so into realizing that almost every pitch, this could be the one that changes the course of this game. And uh, you could see that intentionality that um, our players, they, they, they felt it, and uh, they just stayed engaged engaged in the game and made, made good plays the rest of the way. Annie? Hey, Mike, um, what, what can you say about Kyle Zimmer there uh, in the 10th to, to lock up his first major league save? Yeah, pretty special. And, um, you know, came in and used his secondary pitches, too. It was behind in the count, not afraid to throw the slider back door, use the curveball. Um, you know, just uh, I thought he, he kept um, everybody off balance. and But he, he threw strikes. And to be able to throw strikes with more than just your fastball is pretty important in a situation like that. Also, just getting strike one, right? That got us in a little bit of trouble there for a couple innings, working behind in the count, lead off walks. Uh, those typically don't turn out real uh, real positive for us, but in that situation, and we we, uh, we try to think through what that tenth might look like, and if we have somebody that we know, one can control the running game, two can field their position, and three uh, can control the strike zone and work ahead. Uh, those are the kind of guys uh, that we want going out there, knowing that you have a man on second base with nobody out. And Kyle Zimmer, um, he, he fit that role perfect today. Carlos, I might. What do you think about the performance of Jesse Han, who was allowed to home run again? Yeah, um, you know, velocity was down a little bit too. Um, I, I always just get concerned when we have so many of these days off. I really do. I think you can have guys that um, are just almost under conditioned, uh, even though we did get to throw him uh, in Cleveland quite a bit too. Uh, you know, just he's got the kind of stuff that we believe in and can, can face any part of the lineup in any uh, any time during the game. Um, but he recently had a little tough run. I'm uh, just going to need for him to get a couple things figured out. You're talking about, you know, high velocity, um, extreme movement, and uh, one of the better spin curveballs in the game. Uh, you throw that mixed together, and it should be effective. But uh, right now, it, it, it can be uh, a confidence issue, too, when you have a couple tough ones, uh, especially every one of these guys want to come in when we get a lead, and they want to shut the door. Um, but it didn't happen today, and uh, we're going to continue to to give the opportunities uh, to guys that we feel have the, the makeup and the, the stuff to get us out of those spots. Thank you.